This is Al Capone, the world's most famous gangster. Born 17th of January 1933 in Brooklyn, New York. The fourth of nine siblings. Being kicked out of school at the age of 14 for striking a teacher, his life prospects did not look promising. Working odd jobs for little money, he joined two gangs of delinquents taking part in petty crimes and vandalism. It would be through this life of hooliganism he would meet his lifelong mentor Johnny Torrio. At the age of 16, Capone would join the Five Points gang serving Francesco Aioli as a bartender at the Harvard Inn. Before Capone turned 21, he would be involved in several incidents at the Harvard Inn, one of which he would have his face slashed by a hoodlum named Frank Galuccio, prompting the nickname Scarface. After this incident, Capone's crimes became ever more violent, murdering a winner of a local neighborhood betting game of his winnings and brutally assaulting a low-level member of the White Hands Gang. This would not go down well for Al Capone with the White Hands Gang, seeking retribution for his actions. Not willing to give up Capone, he and his family were sent to Chicago to work alongside Johnny Torrio. Together, they would serve under major crime boss Jim Colosimo. Though shortly after Capone's arrival, Jim Colosimo was assassinated. Many have speculated who assassinated Colosimo. Was it Capone or Johnny Torrio? Regardless of who was responsible for Colosimo's death, this paved the way for Johnny Torrio to rule over the business. During Johnny Torrio's rule, prohibition would come into effect throughout the United States. They would capture this opportunity distributing through underground sales of alcohol, making them both very, very wealthy. This would bring an attempt on Torrio's life, to which they would hire Francesco Aioli and other associates to return the favor. Torrio would be arrested shortly after and do some time in prison, and he would soon retire to Italy. Being Torrio's right-hand man, he was next in line becoming crime czar of Chicago, sealing his name in history.